What made this woman's situation so bad that doctors were willing to attempt the first ever face transplant? Her name is Isabelle Dinois and she's a French woman who looked like this before her life was turned around forever. Just after the turn of the millennium, she went through an extremely bad bout of depression and then in 2005, she took quite a few sleeping pills and was left on the floor unconscious. Her hope at the time was never to wake up, but her Labrador had other plans and as he got more and more agitated at the fact that she was laying there, he started gnawing at her face. She woke up in a pool of blood and this is what was left of her face. When she went to hospital, the plastic surgeons ruled out an ordinary reconstruction because of how much tissue was damaged and so needed to perform a face transplant. It was a complex 15 hour operation, but was a massive international success. This is what she looked like after recovery, saying that she never found the person she was before the incident and she always saw the donor's face when she looked in the mirror. She survived 11 years with it, but the dog was put